Hey guys, I'm LB, and I got a request to play Overgrown Testing Track Number 1 by Aperture Laboratories Ace. Hello, and again, welcome to Aperture, where we, 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 we... Recording shorts out. Oops, looks like that recording is done for. Anyway, welcome. This is an overgrown or destroyed test chamber. I might do a few of these if I feel like it. Anyway, enough chit-chat. Time is science. <laughs> Instead of time is money. <laughs> well, alright, let's get started. I'm always in the mood for some overgrown test chambers. It's actually my favorite style in the game. This looks like a, a B mod one, or at least I think I've seen this as a B mod intro. Because this message is pre recorded, oh, yeah, yeah, is the enrichment center has no way of knowing if whatever government remains offers any sort of cattle tuberculosis testing credit for taxes. <laughs> In the event that it does, this next test involves exposure to cattle tuberculosis. Good luck. I don't think I've heard that dialogue before. Or if I have, I've just forgotten. <laughs> I mean, I know it's not used in the game, but I thought at one point I'd listened to a video that had all the unused dialogue in it. I don't remember that. Okay, so that just opens the exit. And this reopens the portals, I guess. Are we gonna get a portal gun at some point, or... Oh wait, which one of these gave me... Did I get the key from here? Yes, I did. Alright, so that other dropper is something else. And it is connected to... What? Oh, it goes through here and to there. Oh, okay, we can do that. That gets us another laser cube. Which, I guess we can just angle this one like this and be done with it. Whoa! That's a bright light. Was not expecting that. Let's see, and then this is that. Oh! <laughs> yep, this is a pretty simple first puzzle here. So we'll actually want to point this at the button. So that way the cube can be on the button and, uh... Yeah. For some reason I'd forgotten that we'd already used that one. I was like, wait, what does that one go to? I was like... <laughs> wait a sec. It's probably on this side intentionally so that you can keep the laser here. Without, without having to turn around too much. Oh, come on, game. There we go. Jump over the laser, and on to the next. Hey, here's our portal gun! Well, that was an interesting sound. We've got crushers here, and speed gel. This looks suspiciously familiar. Oh, I did- <laughs> I just tried to right-click and then nothing happened, and I was like, Oh yeah, we only have a, uh, we only have black portal. That did not quite have the effect I was hoping it would. Oh, I see. Conclan was making fun of me for... Me and Anne's not. Conclan was making fun of the both of us for, for not knowing this trick while we were doing live streams on the, the co-op live stream. To be honest, it's not used very often. I always forget about it. Okay, let's, uh... What's the best way to stand in here and, uh... Okay, so we've... We definitely have not coded that side appropriately. This side is a bit better, though. So I think we just want to shoot earlier, and that'll get us this part here. That part's gonna need a lot more coding. Alright. Did that do the trick? Eh, good enough. Close enough. Oh. <laughs> Somehow uncrouching sent me through the portal. That was quite strange. So if we do this... Let's see, how, how much did that do? Why can't I... If you're not already walking fast enough, you can't... you can't walk over this. What's the deal with that, B-Mod? What the heck? 
Like, I'm holding forward and nothing's happening, except them going side to side. But, if you start fast enough, you can just walk right over it. Alright, so, that looks sufficiently coated. Yeah, I'm happy with that. Okay, so now... This just respawns the cube. What exactly is our end goal here? This and that. Oh, okay, so we have to go here first to spawn another cube. And then... I'm assuming we're not supposed to toss the cube into there and we're supposed to go of the runaway. May want to put a fizzler there if the player is not meant to toss the cube in there. Alright, so. Let's get over here. And, uh... Wait, do we even need to take this... Let's just do this cube first, why don't we? Well, hang on a second, let me think about this. We only need to stand on that button temporarily to get that cube to spawn, and we can just put it directly on the button. So this one, we'll want to do that one. Okay, okay. What is the best way... Do we need the cube to just... Oh, we need the cube to slide. That's why the funnel's there. Hope that's aim-assisted. Looks like it is. Come on. <laughs> yeah, it looks like a thing assisted. That's good. Come on, Cube, you can do it. Oh, what is the deal with that? Do I have to run it over there or? That kind of looks like a portal surface, but it's not. Alright. Fair enough. Maybe I just have to go in myself. No, because I fall faster than the cube. Oh, that's an idea. It's gonna be really tricky, though. Oh, now I'm not falling faster than the cube. Kinda. that up. I thought that was aim assisted. Apparently not. What? What did I just do? Did I just re-fire the portal? How did that happen? Oh my gosh. This is, this is, uh, this is painful. Get in there, cube! Oh, come on, you're so close! Oh, <laughs> forgot to replace the portal, my bad. That thing is just not getting the distance it needs. It's definitely all, uh, gelled up, right? Oh, that is not what I wanted to have happen. Neither is that. Oh, that's the top. Okay, that's why I'm confused. Yeah, that's definitely gelled up enough. Wait a sec. Do we need both? Oh, that would explain some things. So I have to be on that button at the same time as... okay. I still would like to know, though. Maybe this will help. I don't know. <laughs> Perhaps. I should have thought of that a long time ago. Hey, 
what do you know, it actually did help. Alright. Why didn't I do that a long time ago? That makes a lot more sense. How did I not die just now? Oh well, it'll work. We have a cube! Alright, and then... Oh, that one just stays up there and it's supposed to be. Right, 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 okay, good. Good, good, good. On to the next. This is... a strange... petty hallway. What the... was that just me? That- that looks like it came out at an angle or something. Alright. Hey! It's the dual portal device. And, uh... looks like the other portal is currently not assigned. Seems that way. Auto lift. Oh, we just walk up here and get it. <laughs> is this something new in B mod or what's this done in Hammer? This is. This is strange. Alright, enough of that. Uh. What exactly did we want to do with this portal surface? Oh. So once we've done that, we can head up here. I'm not sure why I slipped into a Texan accent for a moment there. I am from Texas, but I don't normally have a Texas accent. Whee! That was plenty more height than we needed. Alright, we have this. What do we want to do with it? Just get over there? Oh, this uh... Oh, except I shot the wrong portal. <laughs> let's, uh... Let's just, uh, put that back, please. And this time, let me shoot my green portal, not my black portal. Black for input, green for output. That's the way I always do things. And the reason I do that is because the subtitles call the black portal primary, and the green portal secondary. Primary for input, secondary for output. That's the way I always do things. Let's see, so now we want to do this. Just get some gel there, and then we do the- the flimaru With the cube. So this is, uh... <laughs> oh, well, that's, uh... That's one way to do things incorrectly. Maybe I can grab this on the way down if I put this in just the right spot. Let's try that. We'll work on that assumption. And if not, Wheatley will just have to locate my dead body. Okay, well, let's just do this. Why don't we? This is a lot easier to do. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't just do that before. That- that is totally a jumpable distance. I was massively overcomplicating that, as usual. Cause that's what I do on this channel, I overcomplicate things. Got some pressures happening somewhere. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, what are the requirements for exiting two cubes? So, we can just run along over here and reach all the cubes. Except the button's gone! So, what does that mean for us? We can get this cube, right? So, we head over here, put this cube down, right? What are we going to do about this other one? I guess we just need to go and grab it, right? I'm not sure what else we would do. Wait, what am I doing? 
this, this. Ooh, crap. I'm not sure how I survived that, but I did. Okay, so that's how we get out. Except I, uh, I messed it up. There we go. Uh, hello? Said, let me out, please. There we go. I probably could have jumped on the cube as well, but. I, I it doesn't matter. Oh well. Alright. Portal there, portal there, portal there. Thank you. And we are out of here. Well guys, as always, thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. And you can show your appreciation to the two buttons below the video. I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye!